Hey everyone, this Hello. is the, the teapot. teapot. This is the first episode of our show. We're doing the, the teapot. It's uh, We're going to talk about pop culture, movies, music, that kind of thing. And right now, you know what we're talking about? We're talking about Halloween. Because it's Halloween. Halloween right now. So that's what we're talking about. Um, welcome to the teapot. Okay, first on the agenda, Can't October know. 27th. Stranger Things is coming out. Season 2. Stranger I'm Things. really excited. Really, really, really excited. I'm so excited. Um, um, it's going to be so good. Like, I know it is. Yeah. Like, the trailers, so good. They're my favorite boys, my favorite little girls, favorite <laughs> people. Yeah. Yeah, um, they're just amazing, and I'm really excited. Um, so that is what I will be doing yeah, all weekend. I wish I could do that all weekend. I have stuff to do all weekend, but... Yeah. Anyways, I wish you I can tell it's things. Halloween from my mask. It's Halloween because she's wearing a mask. I'm going to take it off. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, if you need something to do on Halloween or the weekend before Halloween, you can watch Stranger Things Season 2 on Netflix October 27th, which is Friday. That may have already happened. Probably did. Yeah, it did. But watch it because it's good. Yes. Okay. Next, some fun things to do for Halloween. Fun things. Well, there's like a bunch Halloween of things. great Halloween movies you can watch. And we have a list. Um, what are the best Halloween movies of all time, you may be asking, while you're sitting here watching this great show? Well, we're going to answer those for you right now. Woo. Okay. So, my personal all-time favorite is Halloween Town, not number three, because they switched actors for number three, and then it was terrible. No wonder they didn't make a fourth. But Halloween Town, number one and two, are amazing. You know what else is a good movie? Um, same kind of Disney thing. Hocus Pocus, totally watching Hocus Pocus. However, um, we got a reboot for Hocus Pocus, Pocus coming out, and you know what? It's going to be terrible. You know why? Because they're changing the cast. It's going to suck. But you know it isn't going to suck? The original Hocus Pocus, because it doesn't change, because that's not how movies work. So you can watch that whenever you want, unless you don't own it, in which case, I'm sorry, you can't. It might be on TV. You can rent it on TV, which would work. So Do that. Yeah. So, I like that one. Hocus um, Pocus, another so great good. Halloween movie, oh, yeah. classic. Another great one is The Addams Family, which yes. our school actually did a musical on last spring, and it was pretty good. But you can um, watch the original yeah. movie. If you want to watch okay. the original movie, you can find that. Or if you want to watch the Petaluma High School Trojan Perform Troy Performers production of The Addams Family, you can find that on the Trojan Live YouTube channel at YouTube slash Trojan Live. <laughs> That's yes. not what it is. But go to our channel, and you can find a full recording of the Adams Family musical if you want to watch that this Halloween. It's actually incredibly good and really funny. we got some good performances in there. Or you can watch the actual movie, and that's really good. It's a good movie. Yeah. I like it. A uh, horror movie that just came out is It, and I personally it. have not seen it yet. I really need to. It looks pretty scary, yes, but scary. I want to see it because it's spooky season. Uh, also, you know who else is in it? Finn Wolfhard is in it. Uh, yeah. One of the main characters is Stranger Things, best TV show of all time. Go watch it. Stranger Things Season 2 coming out October 27th on Netflix. It's going to be really great. I'm really excited for that. You yeah. Know what if you want if you want to get a bit more scary, or maybe not more scary than it, but if you, if you want to get also scary, you can watch Halloween, a classic Halloween horror movie. literally has Halloween in the name. It's the only word in the name. It's just called Halloween. If you... I mean, if you look up Halloween on, like, Google, you might have trouble finding it because there's a lot of things that have Halloween in it. But good horror movie. I went yeah. to Universal Studios uh, during Halloween. They had, like, one of those haunted house maze things for, wow. for the – it was really great. Wow. That's it was super, like, scary but also really fun. That sounds pretty cool. If you want to be uh, more lighthearted, there are movies like Ghostbusters amazing yeah. movie night nightmare before christmas classic you can watch it on christmas and halloween you can watch what it on movie easter. gets hi griffin you can watch it <laughs> christmas halloween easter your birthday my birthday <laughs> watch it on my birthday and i'll give you a high five that's in like a year but a you can year? watch it whenever it's yeah. such a great is movie. today your birthday no it's not today. exactly so it's not a year it's not so don't watch it today okay or no do watch it today but if you want to watch it on my birthday, then you're out of luck for a while. Okay. So <laughs> Moving on. Yeah, Best moving Halloween on. songs. Okay. We got um, good Halloween music, too. There, there are some Halloween bops. <laughs> it's a lot of scale of fun. 
okay there's <laughs> thriller by michael jackson such a good song there's really also, good yeah. monster a, mash yeah. Also, Classic. if you really like a Thriller by Michael Jackson, not only is that an amazing song, but there's a remix of it that just came out. Steve Aoki put out a remix of a Thriller by Michael Jackson. And it's, it's pretty good. It's, I like it a lot. It's pretty good. <laughs> also, Michael Jackson is a brilliant artist, and it's a brilliant song. Yeah. That's something you can listen to. Or the Monster Mash. You can never not listen to the Monster Mash. I mean, you can probably, probably be weird if you listen to that like during Easter. But yeah. How, it's a good Halloween song. Um, Somebody's watching me. Great Halloween song. In elementary school, I was in McNear. There is a musical, and um, the first graders got to be part of the musical because normally oh. they're not allowed. And we did the song Somebody's Watching Me. It was pretty fun. Cool. Also, one of my favorite Halloween songs, the Ghostbusters theme song, Ray Parker Jr. So good. Or if you want a different version of it, Pentatonix has a good cover of it. So good. Or I think like Fall Out Boy has one too. Oh wow. Maybe, yeah, there's a lot. But it's a really good song. It's a classic song from a classic movie, Bill Murray. And then if you want to get away from the classics, there's Monster by Kanye West, beat Jay Z, Nicki Minaj, and Rick Ross. Yeah. Sounds pretty good. This is Pedal My School. Listen to the non explicit version of that song for sure. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. For sure. Or so. uh, Disturbia by Rihanna. That's a bop. Yeah. That's a bop. That's I mean, like, you can listen to it whenever you want. I listen to it whenever I want, which is a lot. But it's a bop. Pretty good. Um, yeah. Good song. Okay. So, fun Halloween things to do yeah. during the spooky season. You can watch Stranger Things, go to a corn yeah. maze, go to a haunted house. Last year, I went to the haunted house for the first time, the Petaluma one, and it was scary, but it was fun. Um, you could cry. You yeah. could watch movies. You could trick or treat like a kid. Yeah. You can do anything you want. It's I mean, Halloween. you might get weird looks and like doors slammed in your face, but you could try. You could bring a child with you and then take their candy. But I yeah, like a that. sibling. Yeah. That would be a good idea. Not a random child. Also, I don't think. So, you if do you want to go to Corn Maze, there's an awesome Corn Maze, Stone, Stony Point Road. If you might have been to it. If you haven't, then go to it because it's really cool. You can go at night. They got food sometimes, I think. Oh they yeah. Got, Big bathtub full of corn. I'm going this weekend Ooh, for my yeah. brother's birthday party. Ooh, it's gonna be happy really birthday, fun. your brother! Yeah, he's turning ten. His birthday is on Monday, the day yeah. before Halloween. Yeah, his his present to us all is Halloween. Yeah. Thank him. <laughs> okay. If it weren't for him, you wouldn't have Halloween. You don't realize people think that Halloween it's like oh it's history, you know, it's like the spirits or whatever. No, it's because of her brother. Yeah. The world is given him Halloween as a gift okay. to us all. Um, like a communal <laughs> gift. So, moving on to pop, ch pop culture. We um, got a big scoop here, by the way. We got yeah. A, Simone, so, you want to take away this big scoop? Yeah, I don't know a lot about the logistics of it, but I read an article. And r last weekend, a bunch of Petaluma High students went to a festival um, in the Bay Area called Rolling Loud. And it's a lot of famous rappers. A lot of the kids had fun. I didn't go personally. But apparently, there was a, some drama between two of the rappers. <gasps> okay. And I quote the article that I got this from. Lil B forgives a boogie with the hoodie and his crew for beating him up before rolling loud. So apparently, a boogie and his... A boogie in, with the hoodie... Um, his crew, so not a boogie with the hoodie, his, like, friends beat up Lil B. But after, like, doing further research on this, I think Lil B handled it very well. He went up on stage and he said he forgives a boogie with the hoodie and he, he forgives him. He doesn't want any violence. And then later he tweeted something about nonviolence and he was really cool about it and they made up. So I think that's cool because everyone would be mad if they got beat up, and he handled it really well. That was your hot Pedal High School teapot scoop. If you think that we're not informative, you're wrong because we got news, like about how Lil B forgives a boogie with a hoodie and his crew for beating him up. Yep. Before Rolling Loud. Yes. You know what's an incredible movie? Incredibles. Oh, my Whoa. God. Well... I think we covered everything. I think that's our show. 
Yeah, so this is our first show. Where we are going to make another one next month. And Hopefully. that yeah. was yeah. the teapot. It was the teapot. Look forward to more fun content. We might bring guests. We might bring you. You Watch out. You might be on the show next. <laughs> it could be you. It could be someone else. Yeah. It could be anyone. It could be Cooper Woods. It could be Griffin, Gr- Griffin Epstein. You, you never know. But tune in to the next episode of The, the Teapot. teapot.